Today we're going to be doing a very quick test to see if the Rode Go Wireless 2 system can be plugged in to an exterior power source and still operate. What's up everybody, my name is Jason from EO7 Media and 4 Love Films and today we're going to be doing a very quick test on the Rode Wireless Go 2 system. Now if you've already seen some of my videos in the past, you know that I'm a big proponent of this system. While the first system was really kind of crappy, uh, the version 2 is much better and it has a lot of awesome stuff that you can do with it. I got an email from a buddy last night asking uh, for a little bit of assistance, uh, what kind of wireless system he would go for for a uh, conference type of shoot where he's shooting from about eight to nine hours at any given time and unfortunately these little bad boys here don't have that kind of battery capacity in them and while I do recommend them for great audio and great distance and what's even cooler is if I can turn around and totally block my body the signal doesn't go away and that's amazing what we're going to do today is we're going to plug in a power source and what I have is I have two battery banks here I'm gonna plug in a power source through the battery bank um, and then try and record at the exact same time and see if there's any kind of interference, anything goes wrong. Basically to try to extend the battery life of either the receiver on top of the camera or the transmitter wherever it's going to be placed. So basically we're just gonna jump into this and try this. There's not gonna be a lot of buildup. I'm talking way too much. So to do this experiment, I have two USB-C cables because that is the type of cable you need. Uh, I have a big power brick, which I'm going to use for my receiver on the camera. I'm going to plug that in here. And then I have a small power brick in my pocket that I'm going to plug in. And these are the same ones I use on top of my, my cameras. So I'm just going to put that in my pocket for the time being. And excuse any kind of microphone noise. But I'm going to plug this in. And of course, this doesn't look good. We're just going to keep testing it and see if it's going and make sure your power brick is on because sometimes these little gadgets don't really uh, connect power until it knows, hey, that's something to take power from. And now we're going to do up here. Okay, so here's the power bank. Um, I am putting it right next to the camera. And I am plugging in the power bank into the receiver. A quick note of information, the receiver uh, LED screen on top did flash out. It went blank, but then came back on. So literally right now, anything I'm saying is 100% a test. I am powered up through an external battery on the transmitter and I'm powered up on my battery on the receiver. So everything should be working right now. But again, that's the test. I'm gonna take this into my office real quick, throw it into Premiere and see if it sounds okay. So I have my SD card that we just shot on. I'm going to throw it into my SD card reader. I'm moving the clip over onto my computer right now. Plugging in the power bank into the receiver. Uh, a, quick note, a quick note of information. All right, looks like the audio did go through just fine. No blips in the audio. Nothing changed from the power source, so that's fantastic. So you actually have a way to make these last longer than the seven hour maximum that they do already have. Uh, now it's really good to, if you're doing this at like a podium, you can power source it there so no one can see it. It's nice and clean. But if it's on a person, you will have a cable coming out of it. So keep that in mind. Um, just keep it in mind. <laughs> the other good news, uh, I didn't even, didn't even dawn on me until right now, but uh, you get two of these. And if you're doing a conference and you only need one, you can swap them out extremely easy when one battery goes dead and then just power source the one off your mixing board or the camera. So literally you could have about 14 hours of battery using these two because it comes with two of them. Success, that's fantastic. This is great news and it opens up the possibilities for more creative content. If you like what you saw today, make sure you like and subscribe and maybe write a comment about what uh, you would like to see done or some awesome stuff that you've done in the past with these things. I hope you're having a great day. Be better and do something awesome today.